Okay, you can't, you can't switch from camera to camera while it's on. <clears throat> Hello America, we're out in the field today. Uh, this is a field down south of town that got hail damage real bad. And uh, he's gonna explain to us how the insurance will come out and, uh, what, do you, what do you call it? Well, we carry crop evaluate insurance, it. so they evaluate. They're gonna evaluate. Left. Okay, so go ahead and take over. How so, do they do it? You can tell this field, I'm gonna say 80% damage. It should be a whole field of heads exactly like this one what it should be except for you see where the hail hit that head right there okay but see all this it's broken off it's been hailed about a month ago i mean it just beats it to nothing i would guess 20 percent is left 80 percent gone so actually tomorrow the insurance guy is supposed to come out and they take a unit of measurement i believe it's three foot maybe it's 30 inches so they'll lay down and mark it, and then we'll count how many stocks. Almost like an archaeology site yeah. where they, and, they find dinosaur bones or something? Well, then, yeah, they count how many stocks okay. is in that three foot or 30 inches, whatever that is. Yeah, and then, like, here's a good head that didn't get hit by the hail. You know, hail missed that one. But see all these other ones that are just destroyed? There's a, there's a, what should have been a good head, but it's kinked over. So anyway, we'll sit down. Here's another one that's kink. But we've been cold enough and wet enough this year that a lot of these kinked heads are still putting seeds in. Okay, explain so, that. Well, normally if it'd been hot and dry like we normally are, these heads would just been nothing. But see, we can take, there's still little seeds growing in here. Well, that one there aborted. So here's a seed. But the seeds aren't going to be great because it's so damaged. But there's still a little seed in all this. Right? Right there's a little wheat seed. So I don't know if you can see that. It's not quite mature. I mean, it's a long ways from maturity, but there is a seed that right will, there. That will grow into a hard wheat seed. Yes. Yeah. You call them berries? Yeah, wheat they're wheat little berries. wheat berries. Okay. So, uh... So anyway, we evaluate and figure out how many seeds are there, how many is not there, how many there would normally have been there. And we it's insurance, just like insurance on a vehicle. We had a crash okay. by the hail. How so much? we figure out what the value is left, and then the insurance company pays me a percent. Okay. You know. So if it's completely so, wiped out, there's zero, nothing here. Right. It'd be 100 percent. 100 percent. Yeah. Of what you're insured for. Correct. Okay. Correct. Yeah. Um, and, and if it's 50 percent, then they, they pay yeah, you 50 percent, and then you harvest it and make the rest of it up. Yeah. Okay. Exactly. Okay. Exactly. So here, I'm guessing this field at 80 percent maybe 85 the the difference will be is what how many of these heads go ahead and make seeds what's determined like see that one is kinked right here the hail hit it it was broken off like that here was a leaf on it which see the leaves are just nothing so that what determines is how many seeds are still in this good head and that's where the landowner or the farmer sits down with the insurance adjuster that comes out and we determine what's left. So this was hailed about a month ago. I said, normally there would be nothing left, but we've been so cold, so wet, rain every third day. Mm -hmm. It's that, kind uh, of salvaged it a little bit. It, yeah, it is allowed where normally all these kinks, like here, that would have just died immediately. If it had been 90 degrees or 100 degrees, this head would have just immediately died but because it was so cool it still allowed nutrients to go through that kink right there it didn't die so therefore that head is a harvestable head okay. so anyway this is what a field of badly held wheat looks like i can guess an 80 percent and we can take some videos of some nice wheat and if you put it side by side it'll be easily comparable all right let's go find some nice wheat there you 